Young people everywhere have ideas, passion, and energy to change the world, but they need the skills and the support to lift their ideas off the ground. And that's why we created the Sprout eCourse and Pearson Fellowship for Social Innovation. Since 2008, over 350 young, courageous people from over 40 countries worldwide have taken the Sprout eCourse to craft successful social change initiatives. We created an online social entrepreneurship curriculum leveraging the power of social media. Participants are able to share their experiences, their challenges, and their lessons learned. And together this forms an incredible global community of youth leaders. In my community, where I've grown up most of my life, there's a lot of violence. And I know that a lot of the youth are really, really interested in the arts. And the arts give you an opportunity to gain that confidence to go out into your community and promote the message of peace. My project is called Theatre for Peace. The idea is to get youth to come together and share their experiences of violence in their community through theatre. In Canada, we have done a great job at uh, looking at the challenges that adults face when they come into the country. But the truth is, there wasn't really much uh, around uh, young people looking for a space to really just connect with other young immigrants. The idea of Immigrant Youth Canada initially was centered around uh, creating uh, some type of physical meeting space uh, for uh, young people in Toronto to be able to connect with each other to opportunities uh, and to resources to empower them to really live up to their potential. I started learning about food issues uh, in the global system and was really shocked and decided I wanted to try tackling it uh, at a community level. My project is a Young Suburban Growers Program and it turns otherwise unproductive yard spaces in Mississauga into organic vegetable gardens, educating youth about real food and why local food is important and also global food issues. I heard about Sprout through the YMCA. I was working with the YMCA in the summer, so I had to figure out what my mandate was, what um, the goals of my project were. It was really cool to actually take this idea and put it down on paper and actually see that this is possible. After applying for the course and actually getting accepted, I was so excited to finally be part of a group of young people who all had a, an idea but really wanted to take it into action. I had deadlines, I had a mentor, I had to report and this really kind of made it more real for me. It gave examples, it gave uh, accountability because every week my peers would be commenting and giving feedback. You're sharing this space, this online space with people from all around the world who have these ideas and want to make some change in the world. So being able to connect with a global community, with people from India to Africa, gave me motivation and encouragement to continue trying to create positive change in my community. The Pearson Fellowship for Social Innovation picks up where Sprout leaves off. We began the Pearson Fellowship for Social Innovation with the intention that we could support the best and the brightest Sprout participants to launch and grow their social change projects. The Pearson Fellowship offers seed grants, one-on-one -on -one mentoring, peer support, and online resources to launch. I was able to get a grant and I have peer support and an e-mentor. That means that I could take this idea that I had developed for the last three months and actually make it happen. It was enough money to help us get uh, more serious. I have more of a sense of what it means to be a social entrepreneur and what sort of vocabulary is out there in order to effectively uh, articulate and present the project to get others involved. Our fellows are having real world impact. Their projects are reaching thousands of people in their local communities. And globally, they're looked to as examples of hope and possibility for the future. My final goal for this, after I implement it in my community and establish it, I would love for it to go global. Sharing a backyard space with people who you might not have otherwise met and working towards a common goal, it's a beautiful thing and it's been really encouraging. I realized in the very first few weeks that my project was going to be an online space and not a physical space. My hope is that we will build a network of learning and uh, opportunity of the challenges that young people are facing, quite frankly, everywhere in the world today. We all have ideas that are floating around in our mind and we really want to put it into action but then get overwhelmed at how many barriers there are and what the Sprout E course does is help you take that idea, put it onto paper and then if you apply for the Pearson Fellowship you can take what's on the paper, your idea that came from your mind and actually make it happen and 
that is one of the best parts of what Taking It Global is doing and why I am so thankful to be a part of both of those initiatives. Join us at sproutecourse.org and be part of a movement of young people changing the world.